these are Scottish Highlands. Uh, very, some of them are crossed with like a Dexter, but very good tempered cattle, very hardy. They do extremely well uh, in cold when they give birth without any assistance or very little problems. The bull back there, the guy with the big white stripes, the belt of gallows. Yeah, he's a handsome fellow. He's very personable, too. One of the nicest bulls I've ever met. You don't hear that said very often. Malik. <laughs> Little guy's like, go ahead. Come yeah. on over here and try it. Shepherd, so yesterday's eggs and today's, it's not been too hot, but there's probably a dozen and some change in here. Huh. No sub or blue or pink. Let's see. Blue. blue or pink. Yeah. There are some that are green, but they're not really laying yet. So this is an Americana, probably. Probably one of the most friendly and easygoing birds. And they lay the blue egg in particular. Hmm. This is a well summer. His name is Cornelius. He's a young rooster. Uh, we named him Cornelius like the cornflakes rooster, you know. <laughs> that's what he looks like. He does. Now, sure does. This is an Americana rooster. He's really young. He'll be, uh, he'll be very handsome one day. And then there's another Americana hen. And then there'll be a whole bunch of chickens in here. So I just built this area kind of, this was an old calf shed. And it was just not being used. So uh, there was like lumber being stored in here, so on and so forth. So what this allows me to do is either quarantine chickens or whatever. Just maybe. like we're doing right now, you kind of yeah. got them penned. Well, I could put, you know, let's say, uh, see the black ones? I could just lock the black ones in here and then they're all the same breed, Aracanas. And then uh, the black ones would breed. Let's run around it. Don't touch it, guys. Don't touch it. <laughs> this That's is funny. Uh, the mama chicken one that just hatched out a bunch of chicks. This is Brunhilda. The hens only get named if they hatch out chicks. And the roosters only get named if I like them. Otherwise they wind up as lunch? Uh, more like chicken noodle soup or chicken and dumplings. Uh. Uh, rooster is a pretty tough bird, you know, in many, many ways, but in particular when we're cooking it. Hmm. So, this is the first year and time I've ever kept my chicken in um, I've always just let them range about. The problem with that is, I've got intense predator pressure this year, and I've also got dogs.